Real Housewives of New York's Luanda Lesseps checks into rehab following arrest The stars at the various Real Housewives shows on Bravo deliver their fair share of drama on the small screen, but one member of the Real Housewives of New York cast recently delivered some real-life drama that may have long-lasting consequences. Luanda Lesseps was arrested earlier month for disorderly intoxication in Palm Beach, Florida. Now, the Lesseps announced via social media her intention to head to rehab, posting this, picked out twitter.com slash dhku6 renew, Luanda Lesseps, at Countess Luanne, December 29, 2017 Luanda Lesseps post on Twitter is quite clear that she won't just move on from the incident in Palm Beach. Instead, she means to take steps to prevent herself from engaging in any other actions that put her on the wrong side of the law. Although she only refers to her alleged actions and doesn't get into specifics, her message indicates true regret at what happened. In case you missed what happened, here is how it all started. Luanda Lesseps was in Palm Beach on December 24, and she allegedly slammed a door, kicked a police officer and threatened to kill onlookers before she was arrested. The arrest was ultimately for disorderly intoxication, resisting arrest, battery of an officer, and making threats against a public servant. According to ABC News, the Real Housewives star didn't spend time in jail, however, as she was released on her own recognizance. She's due back in court on January 25th, which will presumably be either after her stint in rehab is complete or during a break from rehab. Her announcement on December 29 that she intends to enter rehab is the second time that Luanda Lesseps addressed the incident on social media. She shared her first apology on the afternoon of Christmas Eve and went on to explain that this journey to Palm Springs was the first time she'd been there since her wedding the previous year. According to the message, returning to Palm Springs brought up varied emotions. It's not shocking that Luanda Lesseps would feel emotional at returning to where she was married to Tom D'Agostino back on New Year's Eve in 2016. The marriage did not last very long, as they announced their split back in August. The 2016 wedding didn't result in a long and blissful marriage, and it's understandable that Lesseps would have a lot of feelings about being back in the place where she was married. Both apologetic posts make it clear that she is not not attempting to use her emotional response as an excuse for her disorderly actions and we can only hope that checking herself into an alcohol treatment center will change her life for the better. Stay tuned to Cinema Blend for the latest in TV news. If you haven't yet decided what to watch in the new year, our handy mid-season TV premiere guide can show you when shows will hit the airwaves in 2018. If thing is more your style, swing by our 2018 Netflix premiere guide. For shows that aren't lucky enough to be returning, check out our rundown of 2017 TV cancellations. If you intend to celebrate New Year's Eve on the small screen, our breakdown of ways to watch the ball drop can help you decide what to tune in. Please enable JavaScript to view the comments powered by